guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I hope everyone is doing well. Today we have a quirky outfits video. Ooh, I haven't done like a video where I style like quirky outfits in months. So I thought, you know what, it's the new year. I wanna bring back some quirky outfits and I feel like I'm gonna bring back weekly editions of this video but I'm gonna switch it up each week so I'm gonna have sort of like a 90s theme and then like a clueless theme video and then I want to do like early 2000s like I have so many ideas and I want to bring them on a weekly basis so that you know that I'm bringing you like styling videos every week that's my plan so Today I'm just going to be showing you a few different quirky outfits. I do hope you enjoy this video. Please give me a big thumbs up if you do and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And yeah, I will just get on with it. By the way, do you like my hair? I think my hair looks really cute like this. I saw some girl with it like that on TikTok. I also have TikTok now, by the way. If you want to go follow me, I'll leave my link to my bio. No, link to my TikTok in my bio. So... Okay, so first outfit, we're keeping this cute little top on. This is actually a shirt that is for my dad's wardrobe, but I've just tucked it under. Then this is just a little check skirt, like a cute little tartan skirt. I'm obsessed with tartan skirts at the minute. I think they're just so easy to style up and they look so cute. Then this bag was actually a couple of pounds from a charity shop and I just love it. I think it's such a cute little look. And then I just think if you have your hair like in cute little... A cute little pigtail, not pigtails, what are they called? They're not space buns, they're just kind of like, I guess they are pigtails. Half up, half down. I love it, I think it looks really cute. I definitely wear this to a festival, to a rave, just going out on a night out. I think it's very cute. These shoes are just from um, eBay or Amazon, excuse my bruise on my leg. So yeah. I will link everything down below by the way as well. So if you wanted to go a bit grungy, which I really like doing from time to time, I've just popped on this vinyl coat, which is absolutely stunning. It is from ASOS and I just love it. I think it looks really cute with biker boots. And I love the contrast of the pink fluffy, because obviously pink fluffy, pink fluffy bag, because obviously like this is a very grungy look, but if I had little pink um, hair scrunchies, how cute would that look like that would just look amazing so yeah this is really cute and i just like a bit of i do like dressing grunge but if i have a sort of contrast bag or maybe like some cute clips in my hair i just really like it because it kind of like puts two different vibes together and i just think the contrast works really well so yeah this is very cute this coat's from asos by the way i will link it down below if anyone wants to go have a little look so another way we have of wearing this outfit i've just stuck on this juicy bag just to show you that this coat is very versatile and you can just chuck on different bags with it and it looks really cute like this juicy bag is a completely different style to the pink fluffy one so yeah you can wear it in a lot of different ways and this is probably my favorite way i just think it's so cute So next outfit, we've got this cute little, I don't even know what colour this is, it's like an orange oversized leather, I think it's faux leather jacket and then we've got this dragon print shirt underneath, this is also another shirt from my dad's wardrobe but I just love it. This bag is so adorable, I got it for a couple pounds from a charity shop which I love and then we're just grunging it up with the same boots and then some misguided jeans i loved a bit of like ripped de je jeans ripped jeans um biker boots and just kind of like mix and match with colors i do love a bit of pop of color that's why i had to sort of chuck on this jacket because i did i did feel like i needed a bit of pop of color to go with the black and the light denim um but yeah this is really cute i really like this a bit different as well i feel like not many people would have this kind of coloured jacket so that's kind of why I went for it it is from a charity shop but if I find anything similar um online I will link it down below so next outfit we have got these cycling shorts that I have had for honestly years I never really liked cycling shorts but for some reason I just love these, I've always loved them ever since I got them and I always seem to be able to style them up and I've been loving seeing girls wear cycling shorts and then a little leather jacket over the top I think it looks so good and then like a plain little top this is definitely something I could wear out, like if I was going out out to the pub, even to a rave like I love this so much and then I've just paired it with some boots it kind of, I feel like the jacket needs to be a bit longer but I still do just really like it, it's kind of like a 
a little outfit I just chucked on, but I was like, do you know what? I actually love it. And when I just chuck on my Ju Ju Gucci, I was about to say Gucci. <laughs> when I chuck on my Juicy bag, it looks sick. Like, honestly, I actually love this outfit. I think it looks so cool. It's definitely one of those ones that's a bit more plain, but because you've got the eyelet belt, you've got the cycling shorts, I just think it's such a sick combo. Like, honestly, I would never have thought to put cycling shorts with a leather jacket, but... I'm here for it. I'm loving it. So, the last outfit I have to show you guys is this... Oh, no, fell over. This amazing jumpsuit that is actually relatively new. I got it um, over the Christmas period. I got it from Nasty Gal. And then this belt is actually from ASOS. I am obsessed with this outfit. Anyone who knows me knows I've been wearing it, like, all the time recently. Because I just love it. I love that it's got, like, a 60s feel to it. Um, I just think it's stunning with the zebra print belt. I actually just had a vision for it. When I saw it, I was like, I just need to get the zebra print belt. And it will look, oh no, my hair's stuck in my earring. And it will look so nice together. So yeah, I love it so much. And paired with this, this keeps slipping off my shoulder. Paired with this um, gorgeous bag, I think it's really cute. I could definitely pair it with loads of different bags, actually. Let me just show you. It would definitely go with this one. This one is also from a charity shop. It is incredible. I love it so much. I'm definitely going to wear that way more often in 2020. So yeah, that would definitely go well together. If you really want to stand out, I would definitely pair it with this gorgeous faux fur coat from ASOS. Um, I love this outfit together. This is like how I wore it on Boxing Day. And then I also wore it out when I went to see my friend in London. Um, so yeah, this outfit is just incredible. Let me just try it with this pink bag. It might be a bit too much. Maybe the pink is a bit too much, but I mean, you can never be too much, do you know what I mean? So yeah, this is cute. I actually really like this. I feel like 2020 is the year of being extra AF. So I'm gonna leave this video here. Hope you guys enjoyed that. I'm definitely gonna do more um, videos showing styling and some more quirky outfits as that is, that is my fashion sense and I feel like I lost it a bit. So yeah, I'll definitely be doing more videos like this. Please like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, turn my notification bell on and I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye.